Hey everybody, it's great to be back after I've had a busy school week. I'm just going to show you a game that I kind of transformed from a real game into my own. So let's get right into it. What you're going to need for this is some teeny mates or like Lego figures to represent your teams. Um, regular six-sided dice, just two of them. This is just sort of like a chart thing, I'll explain that in a little, and I made it with a big game board instead of, because this used to be the board. So, as you can see, I am using this as the bears team. I don't have three bears, so I just use the falcons, and this is the cowboys, I don't have three cowboys, so I use the panthers. So, the bears will be representing the offense, and here is pretty much how the game will work. So, on this little turret thing, you can see if you roll a 2, it's 6 points, which is a touchdown pass, no matter what. If you roll a 3, it is a 10 yard pass, and, oh no, excuse me, 10 yard interception, and you lose the ball. It's a 20 yard gain on a reverse if you roll a 4, and a quarterback sack if you roll a 5. There is a 5 yard gain, gain on the top play, 7 is incomplete. 8 is a screen pass, 25 yard gain for a 9, no gain for a 10, a fumble on 11, and 30 yard pass on 12. So, the Bears have the ball and they're going to be trying to make it all the way up to the end zone. Um, so, what we would do first is it's first and 10, just remember that. So, I'm going to use this little die to mark the down. So, it's first down. We roll it and all together, that is a 5, and if we look at our chart, that is a sack, which means that the uh, Bears lost 10 yards, so the whole line would move back to the 10. Okay, so now they're at the 10-yard line, and there's the quarterback hoping to make a better decision. We roll, and that is a 10, and if we look on the chart, that is a no gain on the run, so they stay there. It is third and twenty, so this is pretty much their last chance of making it down the field. Um, so here we go. We got third and twenty. Let's see how they do. And that's a nine. We refer to the chart here. And that's a twenty-five yard gain. So they would move up from the ten all the way to the thirty-five for a team. So let's check that out. It is now first down, and they're at the thirty-five. That, remember, their goal is to get to the end zone right here, so they still have a ways to go, but they are making progress. So, let's see what they do. They get a 12, which is a, that's a big number, that's a 30 yard um, pass gain on a complete pass. So, they would move up to the, sorry, it's out of focus. They would go up to the 45, the 45 again, the 35, 2, all the way um to the other 35 so they will move up so it is first and 10 again because they gain more than 10 yards in one play so they have first set of downs and they are at the 35 so they're in field goal range right now let's see what they do here all right that's an 11 so you can see here they just wasted that drive it's a fumble so they lost the ball which would mean that one of the players would drop the ball on the play on the Bears team and the defense on this side would pick it up. So then, after that, you would see in the Panth- or no, excuse me, there's a Panthers guy in here. The Cowboys would take over and try to get down the field the same way. So here we go, the Panthers- I keep saying that, sorry. The Cowboys have the ball and they are going to try to do the same thing by getting to the end zone. There's actually no field goals in this game, so you have to get a touchdown, and we'll do one more drive with them. Alright, so that's a 5 and a 3, which makes 8, and if we look at the 8, that gives us only 5 yards, but we will take it so they'll be at the 40. So they're at the 40-yard line. As you can see, it's second down. they got to make it 10 yards before it's fourth down. And let's see, that's a 7, which is an incomplete pass. So they would stay there for third down. They need 5 yards to get another 3 turns, if you want to say. So let's see what they do. They get a 6, which is 
a five yard gain on the drop play. So, okay, so they gained five yards on that play. It's a first down now, and that's how long I have to go till the end zone. So let's see what they do. They get an 11, which is a fumble again. So they lost the ball. The Bears would take over at that exact spot and try to make it down. So I think you get the idea of this game. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. If you want to see any more creative um, games that I make, let me know because I have a whole lot of dice, and that's only the start of it. So let me know if you want to see any more of this. And so nobody even scored on this because they both fumbled. But hopefully there's a better game next time. Thank you guys for watching.